Good afternoon. My name is Chef Rob Dumas from the University of Maine, and I am here today at the Department of Education, uh, and we are working on our Fisherman Feeding Mainers program, providing some training to school food service workers on monkfish. Monkfish is one of the species you might be receiving as part of the Fisherman's Feeding Mainers program. Uh, we have heard some feedback that, that monkfish has been a little bit more challenging to process and deal with um, because of this membrane or this kind of subcutaneous skin that coats one side of the monkfish fillet. So we're pretty clean on this side, but we have this purplish membrane on this side. And so we're going to do a quick video to show you how to remove that membrane. Um, so first things first, I have my cutting board set up here. I have a fish cutting board. And I've got a couple of examples of a knife that you might want to use to remove this membrane. So these are both boning knives. This boning knife is a flexible boning knife, and this is a semi-rigid boning knife. I'm going to choose my flexible boning knife for this because it's going to help me pass between the membrane and the fish. I've also set up my cutting board so that it's close to the edge of the table. I'm going to remove my monkfish fillet here from where I have it uh, kept on ice to keep it nice and cold. I'm going to set it on the cutting board in front of me, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the membrane side down. I'm going to make a little cut, not all the way through, at the base of the table here, tail here, so that I have a place where I can pinch with my finger, and I can push my knife down and along that membrane underneath the fillet, passing through. I'm going to adjust my grip. I'm going to continue passing through, and what is going to happen is we're going to pull that membrane right off the backside. We're going to roll our fillet over and we're going to do just a little bit of cleanup work to get the last of that membrane off of the front and from there we can proceed with cooking and portioning this piece of monkfish.